Hi, I'm Sue with the Ribbon Print Company, and I wanted to show you today a new printing technique that we figured out earlier this month. Um, and I got to tell you the story behind it. It was really funny. We were just um, working on the software and making some tweaks and doing a little bit of testing, and we were just using old foil because it didn't really matter. You know, we didn't want to use fresh foil because we were just trying to run the prints, and all of a sudden we got an effect like this. I don't know if you can see this, but it's a technique that we've been now using that is taking advantage of used foils. And um, Lori, who works with me, says, boy, that looks like crackle painting. So now we're calling it the crackle printing technique, and I'll show you how to use it. Um, it's kind of cool, and I think, you know, it's not appropriate for every occasion, but for kids' birthdays or big banners or something where you want to get a little bit of a different effect, um, we will present to you Crackle Printing, and I'll show you how it works. Um, the interesting thing, as I've mentioned, is you use foils that have already been used. So you might be able to see here that this foil has already been totally used up. I mean, we've used every single section of the foil, and we're actually going to use this to print on today. If you come over to the computer here, I'm going to start a new program and just put in um, a couple of images so that I can show you how it works. I'm just going to put in happy, Ooh, let's see, happy birthday. And again, with this program, you can change your font. So I'm just going to find something a little bit different and fun to use. I think I might make it bold. Okay, so here's happy birthday. And, oops, I noticed that I didn't spell it right. Let me fix that. There we go. Okay, and just to do a little bit something different, I think I'm going to skew this. Okay, so there's, there's some text there, and I think I'm going to put the birthday boy's name in there. Okay, and this guy is a skateboarder and snowboarder. So I'm going to throw in a fun graphic here for him. Like this. And of course we could mess around. I could put this graphic over the print, whatever. But for now I'm just going to put it to the side just to demonstrate how this technique works. Okay, so here's my design. Happy birthday, David. And if you move back over here to the printer, you're going to see that I have offset the printing using this narrow ribbon adapter. And I'm doing that because if you use this technique, you don't want to print right over something that you've already printed because within that crackle print, you'll be able to read the words of your prior print. So you'll always want to offset it. So I've got the, the adapter in. Um, and then if you come back over here, I'm going to press print. And I think I'm going to make the distance between each of the prints a little smaller. And I'm going to print out about five of these. And I have inserted that little plastic narrow adapter, so I'm going to put that, um, tick that there in the software, and we're going to go ahead and print and see how this turns out. You see how it's picking up the crackle here? You see that? Look at that one, looks really nice. You know, each one will come off a little differently. That's a good one. Okay. And there you have it. Crackle printing. A fun new idea for your ribbon print machine. Have a good day.